The 2025 Mazda CX-70 rides on the same large platform that underpins the Mazda CX-90. Mazda's new crossover will use the 3.3-liter turbocharged i6 hybrid and 2.5-liter plug-in hybrid powertrains. The Mazda CX-70 sports only two rows of seats. If you thought the Mazda CX-90 had too many seats, but liked the space, well Mazda has a treat for you. Meet the 2025 Mazda CX-70. Even though Mazda has yet to share the full specs of the CX-70, it does ride on the same platform as its three-row counterpart. The CX-70 also shares the powertrains with its three-row stablemate, which means the CX-70 will sport an array of hybrid options. If you're unfamiliar with the CX-90's powertrains, it's split down by cylinder count. The CX-90 features a turbocharged 3.3-liter i6 that sports a mild hybrid system, which sends 280 horsepower and 332 lbft of torque through an 8-speed transmission. You can crank that power up to 340 horsepower and 369 lbft torque with the high output combination. Rounding out the powertrain options for the 3-row CX-90 is a 2.5-liter i4 that works with the plug-in hybrid system to make 323 horsepower and 369 lbft of torque. As you'd imagine, both of these powertrain platforms are heading to the CX-70. More Mazda. A red car with a white background. Mazda is pushing the sports car forward. Mazda MX-30 F crossover. Mazda pulls the plug on its MX-30 EV in the US. 2023 Mazda CX-90. 2024 Mazda CX-90 is most fun midsize crossover. While Mazda showed the CX-70's interior, the dimensions and specs of the upcoming model are still under wraps. Though, you can see from the images above that it seems to borrow the dash, media system, and diver display from its platform mate. That means you'll have a 10.25-inch digital media display that can handle Apple CarPlay or Android Auto. You'll also have either a set of physical gauge faces with a 7-inch center display sitting ahead of the driver, or a 12.3-inch digital instrument cluster. The biggest departure from the CX-90 appears to be the exclusion of the third row. Now, that could make for more space for the middle row passengers and more space in the cargo hold, but that's hard to guess just by looking at photos. You can expect those specs to hit closer to the expected launch later this year. Pricing, too, should come around the time of the CX-70's launch, 